Hi, I'm Tim, and today I want to try Smash Plus Grab, a new game from the developers behind, among others, pretty awesome Sleeping Dogs uh, game, which was basically a Grand Theft Auto about China and martial arts, which was pretty amazing in my opinion. This is their new game, which is an online or multiplayer only game about robbing shops uh, and playing as a gang leader, basically. So I. So far I only played a tutorial and I know a bit how it works, so I'm just gonna do a quick play right here and uh, I'm gonna cut the search because last time I tried to find it, it took like quite some time. I don't think there's enough people playing right now. Uh, this is... Oh, that was actually pretty quick. All right, cool. So I am ready to go, yes. Uh, this game is gonna come out in early access in a few days. Right now this is sort of pre-early access beta. Uh, which seem to work relatively fine and uh, yeah, you know, it's a um, very hectic and very weird game. The idea is that basically it's, um, I would call it a mix of uh, MOBA with a third person action game and uh, payday uh, kind of gameplay style. Yeah? So the idea is that this is the map that you get and uh, you have to ransack as much money as you can over the duration of three levels um, so uh, how you do it well you run around and break stores and then you can grab the money from there in addition obviously there will be a competitive uh, or competing uh, teams who do exactly the same and you have to punch them in the face to stop them from taking your money um, uh, what's taken from sort of mobile gameplay style or I don't know I would even compare it to say um, Titanfall. So the thing is that basically you as a player have your character which you control directly and then you have a few more NPCs running around with you who are your sort of gang. So it's pretty cool that you know the fact that you can actually uh, get into the fights and say don't kill the enemy player but actually murder their gang so they will be like all alone and will have to retreat. It seems like fighting is not really necessary and you can actually evade it but um, try to fend off basically enemies from the, um, what do you call them, the shops is essential because you want to grab the as much money as possible for your team, but the money are limited and shared among both teams. So uh, it seems like the other players are taking some time to load up, so I'll maybe um, try to cut here as well if it takes too long. All right, here we go. So we are starting, I think, as a blue team. So it does this nice intro cutscenes. The graphic is a bit all over the place, but then again, you know, that's still early access, so it's not uh, exactly in a perfect state. Cool, so this is my gang. As you can see, I have three guys following me and one uh, lieutenant, who is sort of the big bulky guy. Uh, I think he's a healer, actually. So what I'm gonna do here is I'm gonna go over here and uh, break this shop and get those uh, weapons that are I think ranged weapons so we can grab both of them and give one of them to one of my guys so he will be using a bit more advanced gun um, and after that we want to go there we go we want to go directly to the shops because this is where all this stuff happens so there we go here's a shop with the money so you break that first once we break it we can actually steal all the valuables uh, and uh, meanwhile we should watch the minimap because if the other team comes closer we will have to fight them. So the shop is now broken, now we should get all the money. So actually get some scrap as well. And uh, if we can find a good melee weapon, I can actually go ahead and upgrade it. There we go. Um, other team actually is doing way better than our team for some reason. So maybe that was because I first went for the weapons, which is not optimal. And uh, it doesn't seem like our team actually... There's a shop over here, but nobody seems to be breaking it, which is a bit weird. Uh, my stamina is out, so I cannot actually run faster, which is slightly annoying. Come on. There we go. Let's break this one. That seems completely empty and nobody is around. So enemy team seems to be capturing the last store in the middle. So let's try to get this one before they come here, because otherwise we will have to fight for it. There we go. So that's 2.5k and uh, that would not be enough. I think they basically got more. Oh god, there we go. Now we got some fighting going on. That's... No, 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 no. Let's do that, and then punch him in the face, come on, come on, come on, there we go, there we go, that's what I want to see, what is going on, is that, come on, uh, ow, counter, counters are, yeah, you do have like counters in this game, ow, 
As I was saying, when you are basically very badly hurt, you can just run the hell away from here. There we go. I think we got all of them. Um, <laughs> okay, something is not very right with this game. Let's loot the hell out of that. Uh, yes, please grab that. Uh, we still have 1,000 something to go. And we have the loot drops actually coming in. Those are like super valuable um, things that you can get. Uh, and I think both of them are basically guns. So this is a store with a weapon for me as far as I believe. Yep, that's a hammer. So let's grab that. Uh, as you can see, you also get money for defeating uh, enemies. So basically killing them is uh, kind of a viable option. So I think we can upgrade the gun or the hammer I got here. Let's get over here to the upgrade station and uh, upgrade it really quickly. Grab it. Um, brain freeze. Yeah, slow target. That seems nice. Slow is always good. Ow, ow, whoa. They assaulted me in our base. Seriously? Let's do that. And let's do that. A bit more skills. And just murder that guy. There we go. You know, so far that's actually really enjoyable. It's sort of very hectic. But um, the fact that you actually have NPCs that you can murder is pretty fun because I imagine if it would be just players that would be pretty uh, sort of too skill based, let's put it this way, because you know, you can be completely terrible at that and you can uh, suck awfully. So, but since there are stupid AI that you can uh, kick, you can be a bit more um, kind of relaxed, I guess. All right, there are some guys over there, but uh, oh no, there's too many of them. I do not want to go there. Now the question is, what can I do since all the stores are actually gone? So the only way is basically to fight them, right? So let's go help our guys over here. Let's see, what do we have? My heal is almost up. The cooldown, there we go. Yeah, now let's do this. Burn this guy and then freeze him in the face. There we go. And then let's punch this guy in the face and he's almost dead. Perfect. I got some more money. Uh, we're actually winning pretty, pretty nice. And we can go back. Uh, no, wait, 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 where's the store? There we go. There we go. Let's hit him in the face. Let's just murder all of those guys. They basically won't be able to get our stores. Uh, you can also grab the enemies and throw them, I believe. But my character is not too good on that. Um, yeah, you can keep fighting. I'm just going to go ahead and take that store over here. Come on, boys. Let's break it. Um... You know, this is the weirdest setting and uh, sort of the gameplay I could imagine from the guys who did the uh, um, sleeping dogs. It's, I mean, it is melee fighting, so it sort of makes sense, but it is kind of crazy. All right, we have what? They are robbing the store over there. So we have one more store over here, but it looks like it's being robbed by the enemy team, actually. So let's see if we can. Ah, oh, yeah, we can. Come on, guys. Let's burn them. There you go. Have some of that. And then murder them in the face. And that's a player, actually. So murder him. Perfect. Player kill. Ow. Stop. No. Ow. That big guy is... Let's get all the money they had here. Um, this, someone seems to be still fighting over there, but I don't care. I just want my money. Nice. All right. Um, there is actually another store over there that has a weapon for me, I believe. So let's gonna go ahead and grab, try to grab that. Uh, let's grab that guy. Let's freeze him the hell out and murder him. There we go, come on. Die, 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 die. Yes, there we go. Now please heal. Let's not die here and murder that guy, his lieutenant, I believe. Yep, and you die and let's kill that guy as well. And then let's grab, I think Machete is the next weapon. Yeah, let's grab that Machete. This is what I want to see. Uh, ah, there's another guy left. Okay, let's kill that guy. There we go. Now let's get that one. And once we get the Machete, we can um, upgrade it with something awesome and go murder more people. Oh, we got... God damn it. Let's freeze him. Yeah, you, you stay down. And then have some of that. And die. And we got more assholes here. Yeah, you die. I'm just... I'm <laughs> Somehow, I'm much better than in tutorial. There we go, bounty. And let's break that store. And let's grab that machete. There we go. Awesome. 
Uh, now then, where's the crafting stations? I think one is over here, but I don't have enough crafting materials. All right. Uh, fair by me. Mm, so what can we do? There is a boost stations here and there. So we, we got, what, one minute remaining for this round and I think five minutes for four minutes for the next round. I don't have enough materials. Can we get, I guess there's basically nothing else to do aside from murdering those guys um, while we're waiting for the um, new shops to unlock because they do unlock like basically. Oh, there we go. A new guy. Hey, come here. Nope. <laughs> nope. That's too many. That's, that's, um, that's way too many. Let's not die. Uh, they are trying to break the weapon store. All right, let's let's not do that. Yes, yes. Yeah, come on, come on, come on. Let's chop him with a machete. There we go. Nice. Okay, we got that guy. I think I should be able to chop. I mean, those are you know the NPCs are not exactly challenging, and uh, we got this this guy here. And we got a new store open and uh, we got a player over here, so let's chop him as well. Nice leader kill, there we go. So we got that guy left and uh, we have this lieutenant here. Let's murder him as well. Ow, he countered me, okay, that, that actually hurts. That's, and now we, um, no, 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 first let's get rid of this guy who's like just standing behind us. That's never good. Now we can break that store and uh, let's grab all the money we can. Uh, there's actually those big green areas, if you can see in the minimap, those are like super loot stores, um, which basically you want to go and grab as fast as you can, so... And we can upgrade the weapon, which I am gonna definitely do over here, so let's grab it and Volt Cutter, chance to stun targets, that's very nice. Alright, let's... Uh, we got some... that is some military guys, alright. So there's actually some police here as well. Um, whoa, 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 okay, that hurt a lot. Oh, I got I got killed. All right. And I guess my team will be basically obliterated. So those guards are not screwing around. And that seems like this is a really bad idea to try and kill them. Uh, it looks like I'm actually on the first place, not by money, but by uh, kills as well. I killed, well, by, by kills of NPCs at least. All right, let's go ahead and try to help our team to capture that huge store because that's definitely a challenging thing to do. Uh, we're on level three and there's, I have a fourth slot for the weapon. I'm not sure what is that actually. Uh, there we go. So we are coming over here. Cool. All right. Uh, all right, cool. There is a lot of stuff and I think it will take quite a lot of time to actually grab all of that. Uh, yeah, so we got some here. And we got some delivery, so we might as well go ahead and try to steal that. It's right over here, and we got some guys coming over here. Let's try to murder them. There we go, stun him, stun him. Come on, come on, come on. Yeah, murder, murder, murder. Yeah, that, that game is actually really fun. I never expected that I will... Um, you know, I'm not exactly the multiplayer guy, so I generally play um, very little of like purely multiplayer games, if it's not, say, something like Diablo or Path of Exile where it's like real competitive multiplayer. Uh, Overwatch is very much the only one in the last few years. Let's grab that power up. But this is actually really fun. And um, I think I need to get this game. All right, let's get this thing. Come on, break, 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 break. Then we can grab that shop. We got Mega Boost. So let's break that shop here. And oh, I can see another weapon shop over there. And we are winners. <laughs> That was hectic as hell and you probably heard a lot of mouse clicking, but that is pretty damn fun. I think I need to get this game and play more of it. That looks really, really fun, especially for like one evening of crazy stuff. Okay, I'm in second place, so he got the most leader kills and most cash. Uh, yeah, most cash by a lot more than me, uh, but I got more assists and more soldier kills, so I'm sort of a guy who murders everything around. All right, we got some XP, so my lieutenant actually leveled up and I unlocked some... Uh, you can dress up your lieutenants, of course you can. I mean, why the hell would you not be? Right. Um, all right, I'm almost level three, actually, which is pretty cool. I guess that now should put me back in the uh, home screen, I hope. Unless it will start loading the next game immediately. I hope it doesn't do that. Some games do that and I really hate that. 
Yep, perfect. All right, so um, this was Smash plus Grab. It's pretty damn fun, honestly. I did not expect it to be that fun. Thank you for watching, and as usual, see you next time. Bye!